Creating workflows for approvals are a great way to collaborate with your clients and your team, and it's super easy to set up. We'll head over to settings, and under publishing settings, we'll click on approval workflows. I've got a couple set up here, and I'll just show you how it would go. You'll click on add an approval workflow, and in this case, I've got two already set up. You start by giving it a name, choosing the profile group that it should be associated with, and then you choose how many steps that you wanted to set it up for. So for example, step one for me would be anytime a post is scheduled to go through this approval workflow, it'll get approved or sent to Matthew first. Once Matthew approves it, it'll then go to step two, which will be for myself. And again, you can rename the step name as well as the approval workflow name as well. I also have another one called MC Shared Calendar. Same profile group. This is a different workflow now. It's a single step and it's really useful to use things like the anyone can approve feature when you want to use a shared calendar. Shared calendars could be an easy way for you to send out links to clients or other collaborators who don't necessarily need to be logged in users. It makes the entire process a lot easier. Sending posts for approval is also super easy. We'll go ahead and head over to the schedule button. And once we click next, you'll see this assign button at the bottom. When you click on that, instead of assigning to a specific user, you can now assign to a workflow. We'll see here the two workflows that are available within my profile group either that two-step that I set up or that one-step. I'll go ahead and choose that two-step version. And here you can add a note to whoever will be reviewing that first step. Once you click Assign and Send for Approval, we'll go ahead and start through that entire workflow. 